So let's go. Let's visit Yoda. And maybe we too can become a Jedi. Hey Yoda! It's me, your old friend, Boris. Remember me? Hello! I didn't really expect to find him. You already said that! I thought you would be happy to see somebody after living here all alone. <clears throat> well, we're not. We've grown used to each other's company and we're quite happy together. Thank you very much. Oh, you're blind. Yes, yes. How silly of me. What do you live on? Because I haven't seen enough... Yeah. Yeah. I've got some rocks. <laughs> I want to see what he says. I've got some rocks. Oh, great. Rocks again. No thanks. I had rocks for breakfast. <laughs> um... Are these small blob things that I picked up earlier? Blobs? They're my favorite. Thank you very much. I return for you... In return for kindness, all I can offer you is this pretty stone thing. It's in return. God damn it, did nobody proofread this shit? Uh, thank you very much. So I got this stone looking thing. What is it? Carvite. A powder. What? Powder and added to food stuffs before you get ingested. You wouldn't touch the stuff with a barge pole. What? A powder and added? Oh, there's just stuff missing at the top. Awesome. Awesome, yeah. This is a graphical glitch, or was this the case in the original game? I don't remember. Hmm. So, Carvite. I remember, it, even if it's uh, missing in text here, it's a, apparently a valuable substance. At least I think it is. So let's go check out Snorglad and try to trade it with him. Ascend. Snorglad? This is Snorglad. Elect Galactic Interpreter. Oh, it's you again. Remember what I said. You better have something good to trade this time, puny worm. Huh. Could I offer you a well-functioning domestic droid? I, I like that dude. I want to keep him. Hmm. I have some sort of shiny crystals. I'm sure it must be okay. I have some sort of shiny crystals. I'm sure it must be worth something. That's carvite, dummy. Uh, I expect I could give you a reasonable deal on that. You'll have to come down to the wheel world with me to do a transaction. Or you'll have to dock manually because my auto-docking computer is out of action at the moment. And here we go, one of the many arcade sequences in this game. Whoa. Many. It's actually three or four, actually. Ah. They're not that hard once you got the hang, get the hang of them. Ah, come on. Don't be a bitch about it. I had it. <sighs> Rage. Oh, come on. Get in there. Yeah, slowly but steady. Okay, come, come, come on, 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 come on. Gotcha. And here we go. The wheel world. Looks nice, doesn't it? It's not bad for such an old game. 
the huge bulky mass of the Snorglatz vessel dominates the launch bay as it comes to rest, hissing as it transfers its weight on onto its hydraulic landing gear. It lowers and releases your PTV on onto the landing platform. <coughs> Sorry. The artificial wheel well air is easily breathable, if permeated with a smell of something like old engine oil. Mmm. Engine oil. Yum yum. Whoa. That is one big motherfucker. Okay, Snorglad, let's do the business. Hand over to Carvight, scum humanoid. My side of the deal has been taken care of. You are now in the wheel world and I won't pay. Yeah, yeah, okay. Um, yeah, I don't want to die, so... We're in agreement, so here's your Carvight. Thanks a lot, bald primate. <laughs> but I think you are far too trusting. <laughs> it will be the, tr the death of you. <laughs> what the fuck? That was unnecessary, dude. I just handed it over to you. Whoa! He just walked right through that thing. Dude. Is he a hologram? Lucky for me that, ha that he left his gun on stun. Really. Such a bullshit thing to do. What's this? Hmm, a fairly ominous looking gateway that leads from the landing bay to the rest of the wheel world. Yeah, I see that, but I also see that there's some sort of force field that you don't seem to notice. At so close a range it is impossible for me <clears throat> to make out the entirety of uh, Snorglatz's ship, but I can feel the sneering, uh, see, sneering, the searing heat emanating from the hull of the vessel. Okay, so I guess we go somewhere else on wheel world. So we can't get through this thing, it doesn't even... I don't want to try, I don't want to get fried. Woohoo! Oh, great. It kind of looks like a circuit board or something. Let's check it out. This is... Aquarius, no. No, 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 no! Get out, you... No. Shit. In there. Holders. Ah, oh, fuck. For some reason, the first line is cut off now. Oh, we have to find another landing bay. Oh, fuck. I really don't know which one it was. Landing bay rev 91k. Definitely out of service due to recent technical problems. I think this is it. Or at least one of the ones I can go to. Oh, apparently that's not it. What's this? What's this? Uh, Hollerina Stadium, okay. That's not what I want. There's no clue if this is the right one. Ref 1H. It does sound familiar. Well, I can get in. Well, I do seem to remember something else. Hold on. I do seem to remember that I need something from another launch bay. Oh, well, it was this one. This one was okay. Let's remember that. Oh. Well. That's, uh... Sounds familiar. Yes. This is a robot working on something. I think we need the toolbox. It's the mechanic's toolbox. It contains only a coil of high tensile steel like cable. I have no clue what I need it for, but I do think I need I need it. I don't know when or oh, ah now I remember, yeah. What a strange little droid. I think he's a mechanic of some description. Talk to the mechanic? Droid? It's a rude robot. Uh oh. Sorry. Whoops. I think I might have pushed a little too hard. Like that wasn't what you wanted to do, you... He's playing all innocent, but... It's 
clear that he wanted to murder that robot. 